Due to backlash, Sora has been brutally censored, and just with AI videos featuring Jake Paul alone getting over a billion views in the last six days, we need to figure out a way around this. Sora 2 takes things to a level where people don't even know what's real anymore, and it's currently generating millions of views. <laughs> Now we're going to be diving deeper on how to integrate industry leading tools like Soul, Nano Banana, and Sora to get complete control and the highest quality output. And right now Higgsfield is allowing unlimited generations with Sora 2 and Sora 2 Pro. Now make sure you hit subscribe because I'm going to be bringing you the highest quality video editing tutorials as well as keeping you up to date with the best AI tools. So first we need to choose our celebrity or character. Let's go with Jake Paul. Something like this picture will work. Now you can either take a picture of yourself to be in this video with him, or we can just find another person. I'm gonna search something like a girl taking a selfie. Now if we go to Higgsfield, link in the description, we can hover over the image tab. When it comes to merging two images in one, I find that Flux Context does the best job. So we're gonna upload both our images into here, and then write the following. Put these two people in the same image, blend it super well, the man in the orange shirt should be behind the woman taking a selfie. Now if we want to make it sharper and higher quality, which of course we do, we can hover over image and select Topaz. This is an industry leading AI upscale model. Once we select the resolution we want, we have something that looks very clear and crispy and realistic like this. Now we can hover over video and select Sora 2 and basically generate whatever kind of video we want. Just make sure you don't mention the names of the characters, I find it helps to mention that the character is myself. Even then you still might get copyright issues and the video won't generate, they're pretty strict about this. In this situation it worked for me, but if you keep trying this over and over and it's not letting you generate the video, I'm going to show you another way around this using Higgsfield. So here's an image of Dana White and Zuck, and then I'm going to take the same picture of Jake Paul and have it replace Zuck. The prompt I used is put these two people in the same image, blend it super well, make sure they both have the same lighting. The man in the orange shirt should be replaced by the guy in the green shirt, and make it a closer angle so it's a little bit more close up. After that I upscaled the image using Topaz, and now if we hover over video and select this lip sync option, essentially it uses WAN 2.5 and lets you upload custom audio. I find it gets you the best results. So we can upload our picture here, and then I'm going to upload this audio clip of Jake talking. You can either find these audio clips on YouTube or just generate them with AI. So I'm going to type in a simple prompt like the man in the orange shirt says the audio message. The bald man with a blue shirt looks upset. Once you download it, we can go back to Topaz and upscale it again for even better results. You greedy bald bitch. Look at your board. Raise pay-per-view prices and pay fighters less? You're sweating like a pig. It's time to put an end to this shit, Dana. Now the use cases for this are insane. Most people are just using this for brain rot, but if you have clients or make videos yourself, as long as you don't overuse AI, it can really increase the entertainment level and engagement level on your videos. 